I'm Reese and welcome to the kitchen. Today we are in Dallas in my kitchen and we have Mardi Gras coming up and I'm going to show you how to make a very simple red beans and rice with andouille sausage in a slow cooker. It's really tasty. I think you'll like it. The ingredients that you'll need to make the red beans and rice with the andouille sausage is a half pound of andouille sausage a one pound bag of red dried beans, rice, green onion as garnish, one green bell pepper, one medium sized onion, three stalks of celery, you'll need Creole seasoning, and you'll need seven cups of water. Almost forgot, you will need three pods of garlic, chopped garlic. You will also need a slow cooker crock pot with a, te a high temperature setting, a cutting board for chopping up everything, a measuring cup to measure out your seven cups of water, a knife for chopping, measuring spoons, a thin mesh um, colander so you can rinse out your beans and wash them before you cook them, and a pot to cook your rice in. Okay, let's get to cooking this red beans and rice. First, I have washed very thoroughly the red beans, so I'm going to dump them in here. And I have cut up the sausage and I will just dump it on top there. And I have cut up all of my vegetables and I wanted to tell you two little tricks that I have. Number one, while I'm chopping an onion, I learned a few years ago that if you'll light a candle a few minutes before you chop the onion, that it makes your eyes not burn. And number two, instead of chopping the garlic, I have a small grater and just watch your fingers, but it makes it much easier. You can just grate your garlic clove. It's very simple. Just wipe it off. and you're done. So this is my onion, my bell pepper, and my garlic. I'm just going to dump it all in there. And then I will need three tablespoons of Creole seasoning. I'm just going to dump it in my hand here. So there's one. slow cooker and I'm going to cover it and I'm going to turn it on high and I'm going to let it sit for seven hours. You can cook it overnight, you can put it on before you go to work in the morning, but I'm going to let it cook for seven hours and check the beans and make sure that the beans are nice and tender. If they're not, you might want to cook it for a little bit longer, but seven hours should do it. The rice and beans have now been cooking for seven hours and are ready to serve. So while the beans, rice and beans were finishing up, 
I went ahead and I cooked my rice. So just cook the rice uh, following the directions on the box of rice. And I've put it on a cute festive plate. You can put it on a festive plate or bowl. Something to go along with the Mardi Gras mood. So now I'm going to just scoop some on there. It smells so good. You'll while you're cooking this, your house smells delicious for seven hours. So I've got it plated up. And you're going to want to if you like green onions, I've got a green onion here and I'm just going to garnish it. And the easiest way I've found to do green onion is just to use a scissor to chop it. So I've got a little green onion on there. And there is your red beans and rice with andouille sausage. So enjoy.